Okay, problem number 22. What is the approximate value of the sum 8 minus 8 over 7 plus 8 over 49 minus dot 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 plus 8 times negative 1 over 7 raised to 2500? Okay, and then it says, note, the sum of a series can be calculated using the formula S of n equals a sub 1. So S of n equals a sub 1 times 1 minus r to the n all over 1 minus r. So this note here kind of gives away the whole show. Because it's saying uh, S sub n. So S sub n, this means mm, the sum of terms up to n. Uh, a sub 1, a sub 1, this is saying the first term. So this is the first term. And r, uh, you can kind of think of r as like the rate or how much it's being multiplied each time. So I'll just, I'll call that here rate almost. But here it's just, R is just whatever value it's being multiplied by each time. And N is the uh, term number. Okay, and this R is also the rate. So in this case, we have this piece of information here. This kind of gives us all of those parts. So it says, basically, it's just we have eight as our initial term. So I've got eight over, and this is all equal to a sub n. And okay, so 8 is our initial term times 1 minus how much it's being multiplied by each time. That's negative 1 7. See, 8 times negative 1 7 gave us negative 8 over 7. Negative 8 over 7 times negative 1 7 gives us uh, positive 8 over 49. So right here, just minus negative 1 over 7 raised to the n. So it's the nth term here is 2,500, because it's saying here it's 2,500 term, the 25th hundred term, my, all over 1 minus negative 1 seventh. Instead of saying a sub n, I'm going to say a sub 2,500, because that's the, we're trying to find out the sum of the first 2,500 terms. So now we just got to plug this in. So we're just plugging in our values into that little formula they gave us. So, okay. Uh, alpha y equals 8 times 1 minus, uh, okay, I'll do alpha y equals again. You could just do negative 1 divided by 7, but I'll just use our little fraction key. This is all raised up to the 2,500. Okay, that's up top. And then the bottom, 1 minus, and I'll do negative 1 over 7 negative 1 over 7 okay and this gives us 7 so there we go this whole thing would have added to the sum of the first 2,500 terms here would be 7 answer choice B